Hey, thank you, please. An emergency has been reported in the building. While this is being verified, please leave the building and report to the designated assembly area for your group. I haven't made a video in a live in a while. So here is system test 13. Many changes. Ready? BG12L and although it has an LED, it's not an LX, it's just an L. The LED is just an indicator. Okay? For in the notification appliance, I don't have the true alert anymore. I now have the Wheelock MT24 LSM. It's 1575 Candela, and it's currently set on, uh, it's currently set on Code 3 Tone and Low Volume. So, in the panel, it's the same panel, but there's no bezel, and it's rebuilt. And these LEDs are in different spots, which is why there's no bezel. And the panel is set on, hold on, let me make sure it actually is, there. The panel is set on March time, okay? So, and the true alert. I would have put the true alert downstairs, but as you can see, it's in bubble wrap. Because I'm sending it to someone, and he's going to send me another one. Because that true alert stopped working. Because of the really crappy power supply that my panel used to have. I now have a decent power supply down there. And my slipper's covering up the power light. So, yeah. So, let's pull. And reset the system. Now watch how long it takes to reset. There's a reason for that. Because it's got to reset these. This is one of the two 2098-9201 plus 2098-9211 smoke detectors I now have. So today we're going to do a magnet test. backwards and here we go here we go silence and reset and it's resetting the detector yep detectors back to normal so now and I just hung it there. So now let's put the system in walk test. Okay? First up. Yep. Now let's go down to the hall, I mean the living room. Walk test to the T-bar. And as you can hear, as you might have heard, I have the grown integrity back up, back down there. The UMMT is somewhere else, and you'll see where. So anyway, let's go down. The 9112 strobe is way over there. You can kind of see it. And the integra uh, integra integrity grown is right here, in the usual spot. And here's the 2098-9201, the other one. So, oh, I got it backwards. There we go, got the spot. No, oh, I didn't have the spot. As you heard it blinked, as you heard it activated twice. It pulsed twice to indicate that that was zone two. And. Was that? Come on over here. And 278B. As you just heard. Now, now for the the BRK smoke alarm that with the broken horn that used to be in my room. It's ionization and we're gonna press the test button. Now, I'm going to show you 
where the UMMT ran off to. Well, it didn't run off. Where I put it. Remember system test four? Remember how I, remember what I said it was going to do when the thaw came? Well, the thaw has come. So, to the garage. AD seven hundred D, uh, AD seven hundred S, and the UMMT is way up there. It's currently set on continuous horn and low volume. See? Yep. So I forgot I was in walk test, so I went and put it back in normal mode. So. was on zone 2. No, wait. No, no. It was on zone 1. So if we activate zone 2, I mean, if we activate zone 1, it won't go off. But if we reactivate zone 2, it would go off. So, reset. Yep. And that's the new system. <laughs> 